Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. This is Red Ray's Rider, your host. Today we're going to be continuing on, in this episode we'll be continuing on our way to, uh, Atlantis, I think it's called. Uh, need those flowers. More flowers, some guam. Never seen so many trees. Yes, Avawal, it's certainly a more green and pleasant land than Prenost. But the break's just as bad here, right? I'm afraid so. And it only gets worse from here. Okay, bell tower unlocked. Um, Hallelujah Mountains from Avatar, anybody? <laughs> Very cool. Well, let's go fight another bridge. These guys are weak to phrase magic. How are you feeling? A whole lot better than I did a minute ago. Passed over the sun, scared the hell out, man. Gotta love trees, baby. If I ever need more fucking healing potions, I'm coming over here. That's for damn sure. Thirty bomb flags in a quick succession. Mm. Holy fuck! Oh my god. You 
Might want to try and avoid getting hit for a little while. Oh, might I? All right, and now it's time for <laughs> ultimate. No, I'm not all right. These fucking birds are pissing me off, man. Dude. Okay, so we learned our lesson. First things first from now on, we take out the goddamn flying enemies. Because that was fucking retarded. We should have been able to easily take out that horde. Like, it shouldn't have been a question. Set up a fucking campfire first. I'm gonna have to go find some more firewood sometime. Craft. Yeah, I'll take it. Whatever. Upgrade. Um, let's get this up to 30. this we're gonna just let it go yeah there we go okay we need tall aster from now so now we can focus on them we need let's see violet shore and we need uh 20 more and we can max out our cloak as well i thought about using this because it has a higher start off for red magic but like i mean <laughs> At some point, we're going to be using different colored magics anyways, so... Because we have... I, I, I mean, so far what I've seen, we have red magic, we have purple magic, we have blue magic. Probably green magic as well. Um, and by blue magic, I mean the magic we just saw the, the, the weird axe lady using the bridge. So... One more time. Okay, you fucking birds. Does that make things a little easier? I may not be able to protect you as well fuck? as I usually do. Great, that's all I need. Oh, 
Oh my god. Where'd that bird go? There he is. was easier this time. Those birds were still a giant pain in my ass. was once worn by Tanta Pra, its name is Steely Victor. Increases the effect of Prav's signature blue magic. Well, we don't have blue magic yet, but I have a feeling that going over here to get it, we're going to have to fight Prav anyways. Which I know our girl here isn't exactly fond of the idea, but she's really not going to have a fucking choice. Firewood. Oh well. You know, the smell of fallow resin reminds me of the pancakes one of my foster moms used to make. What is a foster mom? Someone who takes you in when you don't have your mom or dad around. I see. And a lot of the time they don't really care about you. But there was this woman, Ava. She was nice. Made me tasty pancakes smothered in syrup. She was the one who got me to read it. What happened to you? She got married. Never mind that now. Let's go find us some other trees. That's not doing much. I wonder. Mm. Oh, I was right. better than I did a minute ago. Oh, 
Whoa. Oh, familiar. We're uh, going to drop by there just because familiar, bro. And then we'll drop by there on our way to the other area. Da, 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 da. Okay. No! Okay, here, weird familiar. Here, kitty, 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 don't run away on me. And we're gonna pet you. Don't do it, kitty. Unicorn kitty! All right. Aw, good kitty. Goodness, you're a regular cat. Huh? All right. Aramarka. Aramark. Age unknown, size unknown. One of Tanta Prev's familiars, she can usually be found padding across, padding quietly around Avalet, seemingly unbecowned by the break. Amak Aramak used used to help Prav with her trials by searching for evidence at crime scenes. She's always behaved dim, dreamily, dreamily, dreamily. When conducting investigations in order not to attract unwanted attention, but it wasn't entirely clear if this was an act or even to was an act even to prav herself. Very cool. Now I gotta figure out how to get over there. Okay, so to do to do okay, get inside here. <laughs> Fucking finish maxing out all our shit. Okay. Upgrade wise, I don't have any Angel Stone or Alistair. I don't have any Alistair. Okay. Hello, kitty. Kitty, 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 kitty. Does that feel good? Okay, Kitty, you're a good kitty. Oh, Anglestone. Nice. We're going to save that for now because we might need it for later. And we got a nugget. I'd love to put it on our coat right now, but... At the moment, it's not used to us. Are you going to read something? All right, so. 
I want to increase this. Defeat three enemies within a single strike. Fifteen times. Um... Actually, hang on. Yeah, we want that one, because that's a pretty good combo we've been using recently, and a lot of the guys seem to be weak to this, so... Challenge accepted. Better grab all the bomb glass we can get our hands on. I think we're here. And surprise, surprise, this place is just as fucked up as the last realm we visited. Well, we just need to find some valor trees and collect their resin and then we can leave. But how do we know which are the right ones? At the point. The councilman said that some might still have resin to offer, but he didn't say which ones. Look for ballot trees to harvest sap from Councilman Trahiti. Shared the location of some places in Avalok Castle Town where ballot trees might be found. Seek them out and see if there's any resin to be had. Well, they probably don't look as worn out as the one they drained back in Sepal, right? It's a start. I mean, this is just sap, isn't it? I would have put a tap in it personally. Shit, no luck. Can't be that hard, she says. Just shut the fuck up for a second. Okay, think. The tree in Sepal was all dried up, right? So the resiny ones probably won't look like that. Well, all I see is trunks, leaves, blue bits. Wait. Didn't Bob say something about blue? Something, uh... It, it's the hue of blue and the bloomers too. That was his catchphrase, right? Maybe it's a clue. Or maybe it was the meaningless rambling of a madman. Nah, even madmen know what they're talking about. I've known a couple of madmen, trust me. Them fuckers may sound like they're insane, but normally they've got a thing or two up their sleeve that you haven't figured out yet. Oh my god, I, I really gotta figure this out. Okay. Okay, jump, please, oh. I think there might be a ballow tree nearby. All right, let's see. I just want to get the right hue of blue. It needs to be able, it needs to be blowing with mana. This one's resined out too. This fucking sideways world is awesome. Awesome. town used to be filled with people. Maybe one day it will come alive again. When the taunters are gone. Cough. 
I am seriously warning you. What? I'm just thinking of that. No, you're not. You're trying to guilt trip me. Not in the slightest. He's such a fucking liar. Like that! Smells like that fallow tree back in St. Paul. Good. And there must be one nearby. Oh, this one's not going to work either. We're going to have to go to that last one over there. I can already see it glowing blue. No resin in this tree either. Is there something in Bob's rhyme we're missing? It's the hue of blue and the bloomers too? The bloomers. Wait, I think he means flowers. So not just the blue veins, but flowers as well. I suppose that could be it. That or the old loons rubbing off on you. He Only really one is way a skeptical bastard. Seriously. Like Oh. <laughs> My fallow tree sense is tingling. Let's see what we can find, shall we? So we're done with. Oh, that's gotta hurt. Oh, this is getting ridiculous. Find somewhere to rest. Yeah, yeah. Whoa. It's growing sideways. Whoa! Incredible how life can thrive no matter where it finds itself. Oh huh? shit. Very deep. Huh. Bro, we made it all the way up there, too. Ah, oh, You know what? We're just gonna end this episode here. I think we're in a bit of a pickle here. Um. Yeah. I will, I will. I will climb back up there for the next episode. I'll catch you guys later. This is Red Brace Rider signing off.